Dr. Chat GPT was just the start. In our last video itself, we saw how a chatbot saved lives, it fixed chronic pain and even out-diagnosed doctors in some cases. But what if I told you that was only on the surface? I mean, imagine a world where AI doesn't just answer your questions, it can almost also heal your body, where the key to, say, curing cancer, Alzheimer's, even rare untreatable diseases isn't a new pill but could become a new model. That future? already unfolding. AI has entered the lab and it's decoding life itself, one protein at a time. It's, it's designing molecules and maybe curing diseases altogether. Let's talk about how it's turning a billion years into one year. DeepMind's Alpha Fold cracked a 50-year-old biological mystery, predicting the 3D structure of proteins. It mapped 200 million proteins, the building blocks of life. What used to take a PhD student four years or maybe even more, AlphaFold did it in a matter of seconds. Demis Hassabis calls it, and we are quoting him, a billion years of PhD time, done in one year. Noble worthy code, indeed. In 2024, Demis Hassabis and team won the Nobel Prize in Chemistry, not for discovering a new drug, but for building an AI model that makes those discoveries possible. Hassabis didn't just stop there, he launched isoformic labs to bring AI designed drugs to the market. Partnerships with Eli Lilly and Novartis already signed. They are worth over $3 billion right now. The mission? To make drug discovery 10 times faster and increase the odds of success in clinical trials. The world is already seeing AlphaFold 3 and Alpha Proteo. But what's next? AlphaFold 3 improved accuracy by 50%. Then came Alpha Proteo, a generative AI that builds entirely new proteins to bind with diseases. Not just understanding biology, but rewriting it almost. But there's also a new twist. AlphaFold, as groundbreaking as it is, might be hitting a wall. It's running out of publicly available training data. And now, a group of drug companies are stepping in, forming almost a consortium to fine-tune a new version of AlphaFold using their private protein structures, based on OpenFold 3. The catch? This upgraded model will only be available to consortium members. Some scientists argue that if AI has the power to cure diseases, shouldn't those datasets be open? at least after drug development is done. Because in this race to save lives, transparency might just be the ultimate medicine. But there's one question that critics have been asking since a while, and that still exists. Can AI actually, really cure diseases? Demis Hassabis says, yes. On CBS, he said, and we are quoting him, I don't see why not, maybe in the next decade itself. And even Perplexity AI CEO replied, Demis is a genius, give him all the resources. So yep, the race is most definitely on. Meta's ESM Fold has already predicted over 772 million protein structures. The race to cure diseases isn't just global anymore, it's almost algorithmic now. Protein folding isn't just transforming medicine, it's rewriting evolution as we know it. Just a few days back, Colossal Biosciences created history that the world has never seen before. It announced the birth of the world's first de-extincted animal, the direwolf. 20 precise gene edits, 13,000 year old DNA and a living, breathing creature brought back from extinction, all made possible by breakthroughs in protein structure prediction. Want to go deeper? Check out our video on how AlphaFold helped unlock this de-extinction feat. The link is in the description below. So yes, this isn't sci-fi, it's science but accelerated. We are not just talking about curing one disease, we are talking about ending hundreds of them. And the cure? It might not be in a vial anymore. It might already be in the cloud. Tell us what you think. Can AI cure serious, grave diseases like cancer, Alzheimer's, or every other rare disease that we have never understood till now? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Share this video with a fellow AI enthusiast and of course, a fellow medical industry enthusiast as well. Maybe with a fellow doctor. We want to hear what they think. For more such videos just like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button on AIM TV. We bring it to you before anybody else does. Think AI, think AIM.